Hello, I'm Tyler Johnson. I'm guessing that most of you recognize the instrument on the left, the recorder, the instrument that every kid learns in elementary school. Maybe some of you have fond memories of that musical time of your day. Maybe some of you hated it. Uh, either way, it's something that most people raised in Western culture did in their early education. This is actually something that started in the mid 20th century, and it was something that was cheap to produce and relatively easy to learn. So many students would be able to get some experience with music. Music shows a lot of the values of the Enlightenment with structure and order and rationality, but at the same time, it has many values from Romanticism with the ideas of individuality and expression of emotion. Now, most of us don't really have to do any music past the recorder in grade school unless we want to, um, but I feel like it should be used more widely in education. There is a growing body of scientific research showing that music is particularly powerful for the brain. Um, I've also had my own personal experience showing this. In February of 2012, I was involved in a car accident and had a severe traumatic brain injury. Oh, the prognosis wasn't good, but to everyone's surprise, including the doctors, I was back to my old self relatively quickly. So brain injuries are kind of complicated and there are lots of factors involved, but I feel like my involvement in music had a huge impact on my recovery. I had done lots of music beforehand, uh, played a few instruments, was involved in small bands and large bands. Um, I also had some music therapy afterwards. Music is really unique in the way that it affects the brain. We have both logical, neurological pathways and creative pathways. And music is unique in the fact that it's one of the few things that activates both together. It allows our brain to come up with solutions for problems that we wouldn't otherwise. So I, I really feel like this is something that should be used more extensively in school. Just like not every kid's going to be a mathematician yet. Everyone has math class throughout their schooling. Not everyone's going to be a, a novelist or a journalist yet. Everyone takes English class. And I feel like it should be the same way with music because it has a tremendously powerful effect on the brain and it's something that nothing else can do. And so that's what I have learned. Thank you.